A real police official says Ryan Lochte and other U.S. swimming teammates who said they were robbed made up the whole story to cover up for a rowdy argument at a gas station on Sunday. Lochte had already made it back to the U.S. before police could seize his passport, but three other swimmers also along that evening didn't. Two of them, Jack Conger and Gunnar Bentz, had boarded a plane bound for the U.S. Wednesday night, but were pulled off the flight so they could be questioned before they leave. It's believed that Fagan is also still in Brazil. A police official says what really happened was the swimmers broke down a locked gas station bathroom door, then got into an argument over paying for the damages with the gas station manager. Police say they did eventually give an unknown amount of money to the manager. The police official says that it was Conger and Bentz who were the ones to tell police that the robbery story had all been a lie. Adam Pemble, Associated Press, Rio de Janeiro.